evidence on MH370's likely location. MH370 disappeared while flying to Beijing from Kuala Lumpur with 239 people on board in 2014. Australia, Malaysia and China called off their hunt for the jet in January. Analyzing drift modeling of a real Boeing 777 wing part for the first time, scientists backed a December report about MH370's likely location. That location is an area of approximately 25,000 square kilometers, 9,700 square miles, lying north of the earlier search zone in the southern Indian Ocean. Testing an actual flat run wing part, has added an extra level of assurance to the findings from our earlier drift modeling work, said Dr. David Griffin, from Australia's Commonwealth Scientific and Industrial Research Organization, XIRO. Earlier modeling had used replicas of a flat around recovered from Reunion Island, the report said. We've found that an actual flat around goes about 20 degrees to the left, and faster than the replicas, as we thought it might, Dr. Griffin said. The arrival of MH370's flat around at La Reunion in July 2015 now makes perfect sense. Last year, Australia's Transport Minister Darren Chester said the December report would not be grounds for a new search because it did not give a specific location for the aircraft. Speaking on Friday, he reiterated that position but said the report had been sent to Malaysia for consideration. Malaysia is the lead investigator and any future requests in relation to searching for MH370 would be considered by Australia, at that time, at time. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe SH channel. Goodbye and see you again. You again.